everyone, I am so excited to be filming today's video for you guys because it's my favorite season of the year, fall! As you can see, I have my little skeleton hoodie on. This has been a video concept that I've been wanting to do for really the past couple of years, but I either don't have the time or I chicken out or things happen. But this year, because 2020, I have the time and the resources, I'm going to finally do it. It closes. First off, I want to talk about why I love fall so dang much because out of all of the seasons, it's it's got everything, right? You want colorful, it's got changing of the leaves, you want outdoor activities, you have hay rides, you can go pumpkin patching, go to a pumpkin patch, make s'mores around a campfire, you want the indoor activity, it's gonna get rainy, you can have, you know, apple cider, you can watch a horror movie. Don't even get me started, that's a whole nother video I'm gonna make on why I love horror movie so dang much. It, it has it all, right? It has the whimsy of Halloween and it has like the spooky and dark edginess of Halloween. So really, it's got it all. It's just by far my favorite season. This kind of energy doesn't usually happen for me. I'm just really jazzed because it's fall. I guess I should talk about what I want to do this year. So I've been wanting to do a series of fall slash Halloween related videos for some time now. So that includes like decorating a pumpkin or building a gingerbread house or telling you guys my favorite horror stories, movies, things like that. And I wanted the first video to be a fall room slash spooky Halloween room. The budget is zero, <laughs> so please don't make fun of my simple little setup because I love it so dang much. I'm filming on this side because it's literally on the other side and I didn't want to show the reveal until the end of the video. I went to mostly Michaels and Dollar Store uh, Dollarama for most of these things and I'm really happy with how it turned out and I want to give you guys a quick video on how it kind of came to be. If I sound really mean in the video to Trevor it's because I was really frazzled. I would love to buy like everything if budget wasn't an issue. Unfortunately I had to think about the pieces I really wanted and so I was getting a little flustered. He was such a good sport and he figured it out and he did most of the decorating for me so thank you so much to him. I cannot wait to show you guys why how great this looks so um i'm gonna droop over to my uh decorating process and then i will flip it over and do an outro for you guys so now we're gonna go to dollarama and then michael's we're going to dollarama first because i feel like any decor that i'm gonna want there is gonna be way cheaper than anything i want at michael's because i think that michael's gonna be at least triple triple are you excited yeah do you think they'll be fully stocked with halloween stuff already maybe of course they will it's september <laughs> This is probably the biggest dollar ever. This is the Tower Rain Oh, these are really cute. I don't have these for bags though, but I like them. I like them a lot. This is the Halloween aisle. Do I need a cauldron? Do I need a cauldron? Yo, this this Halloween aisle is fully out and about. I don't need these because I already have fairy lights, but I do like these vibes a lot. Oh, that's pretty cute. Uh, what is it? Yep. Cause that's kind of witchy. I don't know where did I put the gauze. Okay, maybe not. It's it's shitty because I don't have a window, so I already lose out on a lot of window decor, which I think would be really cute. What are these? Are these balloons? <gasps> no. Do I need tape? Do I want do not enter tape? I like these a lot too, but they're a little too big. I should get a skinnier one, right? Otherwise, I'm taking up all my counter space already. Yeah. That's good. This one says Shrink Up Witches. What is this? Oh! Oh, that's stinking cute. Should I do the skeleton? That one's pretty cool and ominous looking. Which one? Think. This this one. Yes. Or do you like the tombstone better? Or do you prefer the skull one? That would be too much purple if you get. I know. I could change the lantern though. I could change this to the brown. No, I think that works. But just get white. I like that. Now we're getting into like the more DIY section. I've always really liked like big syringes. Trevor doesn't think it's gonna sell out, and I'm really worried it's gonna sell out. But should I just get it? Should I just get it so I have it? I really want this too, babe. 
Well, I like dark cat better. Yeah. I like the little. Sorry. I like the little paint pumpkin. Yeah, you paint your own pumpkin. I know. Oh, there's King here too. More than like eight times gonna, the price. That's how we got a dollar on my first though. But it's got so much witchier decor. Look. Yeah, I mean they're more like. See, they have better quality for sure. Yeah. And like this little thing in like a glass, how great is that? Yeah, no, it's pretty Oh, cr oh, that's cool. I, w I would want a whole set of this. Raven's brew? That's so oh, neat. That's it. Yeah. Oh my god. That is so cool! Wait, does it keep going? Oh no, that's it. Should we, do we need to turn it off? I'm really concerned that I started it something. Rest in peace. Oh, the, the face turns green! Oh my! I jumped out here to curse you, but it looks like someone beat me to it! <laughs> Only time in life where I feel like signs are good. Yeah. It's everything that I stand for. I know. That's why I love fall. Like that would that's, be perfect to put like in your windowsill or something. I know. I do. Yeah. Oh, I like that. That's what I would put in the back of my witch vibe. Yeah, right? That's so cute. That's cool. They're really good for like... That's cool too. Yeah, that's that's cool, cool too. Should we get a little pumpkin? Well, oh, pumpkins are really cute. Do a little turkey? Gobble Your mic cat is pumpkin in the front. Yeah, 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 yeah. How much is that? Eight bucks. Uh, this one's eight, too. Oh, yeah, this one's eight, too. This is way better. Way better. Okay. Well, these, are only, these are only two ninety nine. So it's like what? Two bucks? Original ticket item. Yeah. That's great. Wait, which one do you want? Probably the purple ones, right? Because they look dead. Or I can mix them, mix them with some red ones. Maybe yeah, the maybe the red ones. ones. There you go. I know that's so cool, but it's probably like twenty dollars. How much? Twenty-five. Oh, I was close. How about this one? Well, you buy one, you get one free. Or how about these ones? <laughs> yeah. I do like the pillow. I think the pillow looks really cool too. I kind of like the book of spells. Oh, it's heavy. Though. Okay. How about that glittered up pumpkins? Oh, oh that wreath is beautiful. That's so cool, though, and it's Oreo. That's what's beauty. Yeah, plastic. Yeah, I actually don't hate that. Spooky. Fifteen. Okay, but the Starbucks, ooh, these are pretty cool. The Starbucks cup I wanted would probably have been 20 too, right? Oh, I want these, but they're $4. What are we doing here? Oh, those are finger molds. Oh, that's cool. Ooh, how much are those? They don't open. Oh. Hey guys, so we just bought everything and now we are going to be setting up in this room. I will have to angle that properly so it doesn't show that thing. I would like to do a quick little haul of everything that I bought first. So if my assistant could... That's not important. Oh, okay, well. <laughs> so we went to Michael's and we got these. These are our sticky felts. I went to LA, there's a YouTube video that I have actually edited and uploaded recently um, where we were all M&Ms and it was super cute. And what we did was I literally went and bought a bunch of these sticker felts. I cut out the shape and then you just stick it on a t-shirt and it's good to go. I wouldn't machine wash them afterwards, but they're really great for craft projects. So I highly recommend and um, I'm going to do something different with that shirt this year and that's going to be one of the videos. And... Uh, most of these stuff are all from the dollar store because budget <laughs> and the only other thing I got from Michaels is this flower which you saw earlier. Um, they're a really good deal. I really like the color of it. 
And then we went back to the dollar store and got a little vase for it. It says Witch's Brew. I don't quite like the sticker, so we might rip that and just have it as a freestanding vase. And then I also got this really cool spider mat. And then we got some faux leaves because it's a fall. And then uh, Trevor really liked this little cat thing, so we got that. <laughs> and then we also got a little cool tombstone board that I thought would add to the back. Uh, we have a little tablecloth that has little um, skulls on it. And then I had this a long time ago. I was planning on doing YouTube videos a long time ago with this in the back, but now we can finally use it. And it's a micro string light. We're going to have that in the back. And the last thing is this spooky little boo lamp. It didn't come with ca um, batteries, but we're going to light it up later. And now we're going to put it all together. Da -da -da -da. Here it is. Here is my spooky fall Halloween aesthetic setup. I love it so much. Um, they're all pieces. Oh, there's a plane. Da -da -da -da. Here it is. Here is the fall spooky aesthetic setup. I love it so much. I wanted to keep it simple and I wanted it to be pieces that I could reuse again. Or honestly, if I like this, I might just keep it up all year round. There are finishing touches to this, so just hold on. Are you ready? Woo! Woo! Um, it, I don't want it to be too dark in this room. Um, let me see if I can actually... Ooh, there we go. Okay, so yeah, there's micro lights. I bought these separately like a thousand years ago. Never used them. And finally, they came to be. The leaves are from Dollarama. This is from Dollarama, the tombstone. The vase, Dollarama. The flowers are from Michael's. Uh, this little cat thing, as you saw in the video, Trevor just really loved. Um, and then there's the tablecloth. There's the spider web. And then this. Ah, it's so cute. It's so great. I love it so much. And it's not a real candle, so I don't have to worry about like tipping it over. I like the leaves, it gives it movement. So yeah, so this is the final setup. I just, I love fall so much. It really is such a wonderful time of year for me. All year round, I am a spooky girl at heart. I read horror stories, I watch horror movies, I love the occult, I love the supernatural. And fall feels like one of those times of year where the, everybody else is into it too, so I don't have to be the weird one by myself. I'm really glad that I had Trevor to help me actually do this so that I could, um, you know, get off my keister and film some videos for you guys. I'm so excited. If there's something you'd like to see me do or something you think you'd like me to talk about, I have a whole list of ideas ready. Um, they will be coming out soon. So yeah, that's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll probably be making more trips to uh, Dollarama and all these spooky places. Oh, also Spirit Halloween. I want to do a video there. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you will join me on my other spooky fall Halloween videos and I will see you on the next one.